Hi everybody, how y'all doing today? The uh, Boogaboo Master here. Well, you can see today I'm dressed up in my little uh, redneck attire, or booger attire, whatever you want to call it. I got my uh, my bubba teeth in. See them right there? They're not my real teeth, for those wondering. I've been asked that question over a billion times. Are those your real teeth? I mean, come on, folks. Use your brain. Do you think my teeth would poke out like a horse's tooth? They're fake. I mean, you can obviously tell. I mean, look at Mr. Pregnant on YouTube. He has fake teeth. I don't know. I don't ever see anybody going to his page saying, "Are those your real teeth?" I have never seen one comment like that, because people know they're fake teeth. Mr. Pregnant does not really have teeth that look like that. But he puts them in for kicks, just like I put Bubba teeth in for kicks too. Uh, I do it to make y'all say, "What the hell? This guy looks funny." But uh, that's why I put him in, to make myself look funny. Mr. Pregnant probably does the same thing. Except uh, he puts a pot on his head. I don't put a pot on my head. But uh, he's pretty funny. Y'all should check out his page. He cracks me up. I like the ones where he goes in Starbucks and says, Hi, I'm Mr. Pregnant here. Hold on, what's the matter about the fucking shits and sausages? Something like that. I can't, I can't do his voice. But uh, he does a damn good uh, Elmo impression, too. He's, he's a very, uh, very funny guy. But uh, anyway, uh, on to this video. Been getting a lot of questions lately about, uh, hey, Booger, how's your hair loss and all that? Well, uh, teachers, uh, not so great. I've actually been wearing my hat a lot, a lot lately. But uh, as you can see, uh, it's uh, still falling out. Falling out all in there. I try to comb it and hide it and all that, but uh, I tell you, it ain't really working too good anymore. My mama's been cutting my hair now. She she did a pretty good job on the sides and back, but uh, there's a little bit of bald spots in there and a little bald spot in there, but whatever. Well, my sideburns grew back now. I, they grew back pretty quick. I, I figured they would, but it's just all falling out in there. As you can see, it's a, just go like that, and it's just hair just falls right out. You can just pull my hair and it'll fall right out. I've been to the doctor several times. He put me on many uh, different things. I tried vitamins. I tried all this shit. I tried everything there was, but uh, it's just genetics, and uh, I guess I, I got the bad genetics. Uh, my dad was bald. Uh, his brother was bald, and my asshole grandpa, he was bald. He looked like a bald, mean, uh, evil Santa Claus. He was an evil Santa Claus, but uh, he was a mean son of a gun, I tell you that. But he was bald. But uh. And uh, I'm bald, so I guess if I ever have a kid, uh, he'll probably be bald unless uh, unless uh, genetics skip him and he'll have a full head of hair. But uh, hopefully uh, he'll get to keep his hair. And a lot of people say, why don't you get a hair transplant? And then one guy's like, Booger, just get a hair transplant. Well, first of all, insurance will not cover a hair transplant because it is considered a cosmetic surgery kind of like liposuction and uh, breast implants and uh, all that other stuff people do to themselves, uh, facelifts and all that other stuff where they suck fat at you and all that. And nose jobs, that's not considered a surgery by insurance, that's co considered a cosmetic. But uh, I could not afford a hair transplant surgery. I would try it if I had the money. but. Uh, I don't have a lot of money. I don't have that kind of money. I wish I had that kind of money, but uh, I don't. So I guess I'm just going to have to be stuck with uh, being uh, being bald. But uh, hopefully I won't look uh, too bad bald. Maybe I'll look even funnier and uh, more people will think it's funny and uh, people will laugh at my videos even more and go, wow, look at this, a bald redneck with bubble taste. Ha ha ha, oh that's some funny shit there. So maybe people will laugh at me more. But uh, my friends have definitely been making jokes about it. They're saying, uh, damn dude, uh, losing some hair there. What I hate the most though with hair loss is uh, when you go out in public and uh, you got it all where nobody can see it, right? I got it all combed where nobody can tell I'm bald. And then out of, out of, out of nowhere comes this big wind. The wind just a blowing and I uh, guess what? My hair is going everywhere, and I'm like, ah, shit. Now I go in the store like this, and I'll go like this, and make sure nobody's looking. But, uh, oh, God. 
that's the only thing I hate about hair loss is going out in public because I'm afraid somebody's going to come up and say, Hey, you're bald. Ha <laughs> ha. But uh, nobody's actually done that yet. Well, not yet, thank God. But I'm sure somebody will. They're going to go. They're going to come up to me and say, they're going to tap me on the shoulder. Hey, do you know that uh, you're losing your hair? <laughs> but uh, oh well, whatever. Well, that's all I got to say. Hope you're not going bald. Well, y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.